We have uh, more news that we're tracking. Uh, well, the search and rescue efforts in Vyanand and Kerala continued into their sixth day today, with several people still believed to be trapped under the debris from recent landslides in Churulmala and Mundukai. Vaina district collector also informed that the operation was progressing vigorously with more than uh, 1,300 personnel deployed for today's efforts. At least 373 people have died in Kerala's worst ever disaster. Landslides in uh, Churulmala and Mundukai have plunged Kerala into mourning. Officials worry the number could climb higher as more than 250 people still remain missing. Well, uh, Kerala Minister A.K. Sasindran has informed that uh, the state government uh, and the authorities uh, uh, are doing as much as possible to assist in the rescue efforts. They, he has also informed that uh, the authorities have divided the entire area into six zones and uh, these are being supervised uh, by a team that consists of 40 members. Also, locals and volunteers have stepped up to help those who've uh, lost everything in the disaster. My colleague Pratipa gets us more. There are several thousands of people who are gathered here who are uh, trying to see if they could uh, find details about the missing persons. The near and dear ones whose bodies are yet to be found. The near and dear ones who they are still hopeful that perhaps uh, they could be stranded somewhere. So the rescue operations are on in full swing. We are talking of day six and uh, with the help of drone technology as well as thermal scanners, uh, the NDRF teams, the SDRF, uh, the defense teams, all of them working in sync there. In fact, even yesterday there was a miraculous uh, uh, escape of uh, some of the stranded people with the help of forest officials. The tribals were moved to a safer location there. So some of those very, very distressing stories that we hear, but hope is still alive with respect to more and more survivors who can perhaps be found with the help of all this uh, technology here. But distressing scenes out here because they are still trying to see if they can find their near and dear ones. And those are the kind of tales that they are narrating out here and one cannot really begin to fathom the kind of pain and the loss that they have to endure their homes gone their families gone and they have absolutely no idea how to restart their lives back to you